Hey everybody, how's it going? It's George coming at you with another CCNA video. So, yeah, I said CCNA <laughs> in the last video. I was talking about how I just passed a CCNA, so I'm going to go ahead and move on to the Microsoft certifications, but I had a change of heart. I tried out some of the Microsoft Nuggets on CBT Nuggets, and they're entertaining, they're fun to watch, but I just don't like it as much as I like Cisco. So I decided that right now that I'm still kind of fresh on the Cisco stuff, I'm going to go ahead and go for the CCNP. So right now I'm about halfway through the CCNP route videos with Jeremy as well as with Chris Bryant. Uh, I also purchased a book, uh, the Paul Browning's um, CCNP Simplified, CCNP Route Simplified, and I need to read through that as well. Uh, another thing I, I want to mention is that I purchased a book. And it's um, not CCMP related, but it's a uh, uh, Red Hat Certified Systems Administrator Engineer Guide, and uh, has some pretty good reviews. Uh, actually, excellent reviews. Nothing but five star ratings on Amazon.com, and the book was like something like thirty. $36 or so and I thought you know why not might as well learn a little bit of Red Hat while I'm at it so I'm doing that kind of like on the downtime when I'm not studying Cisco so I just wanted to let you all know what I was doing at this point and um, I want to get advice from people that have done the CCMP before or are doing CCNA or do, do you recommend what I'm doing and if you were in the place that I was in would you do the same thing to go straight for a CCNP. Uh, some things that you might want to know is do I have job experience? Yes. I have three years of kind of like technician experience as a systems administrator. Systems technician, networking, networking technician, things like that. I've done that for about three years now. Uh, implementing EMR uh, which is electronic medical record systems. So, But I've never really had to deal with Cisco switches until now actually just recently I um, some of the clinics that we have has, have Cisco switches and routers so now I'm actually able to comfortably work with them so I don't know is that enough experience to go into the CCMP and then uh, expect to get a job you know maybe not right afterwards but relatively soon so I got six months before my student loans start kicking in so uh, I, I don't know maybe I, I need to move into some kind of uh, full-time job or, or or figure something out pretty soon so just just wondering what you guys think about that and uh, anything that you'd like to say just leave it in the comments below and uh, rate if you like the video I'll see you all next time bye bye